all cnidarians are carnivorous. Both the polyp and medusa stages possess a mouth surrounded by tentacles. The tentacles can sting prey and bring them into the mouth where the food is brought into a gastrovascular cavity to be digested. In sponges, the only food items possible are those small enough to undergo phagocytosis and be brought into coanocytes. Here, however, the cnidarians are able to digest much larger items in this gastrovascular cavity and then absorb nutrients. The cells of the gastrodermis include gland cells which produce digestive enzymes in vesicles similar to the process which occurs in the human pancreas. These vesicles release these enzymes into the gastrovascular cavity so that food may be digested extracellularly. Cnidarians are unique in possessing stinging cells known as nematocytes which produce stinging secretions known as nematocysts. These are the most complex secreted products in the animal kingdom. Once a trigger is touched on the surface of the nematocyte, then the nematocyst is released very quickly. Nematocysts can penetrate a food item or a potential predator and may include tubules which can include a venom. Given that the epidermis of tentacles can possess thousands and thousands of nematocytes, these secretions might be enough to paralyze a fish and allow it to be digested for food, or even to potentially harm a human. Since jellyfish stings can be painful, and in rare cases, even potentially fatal.